They say as humans we have been given the most valuable ability, the power of choice. As the need for uplifting energy is required more than ever, let's choose the power of giving and sharing as it resonates greater in today's world. Hi, my name is John G. Carr and welcome to The Works. Mindset, self-awareness and personal growth and strive towards the ultimate goal of mastering ourselves. Thought-provoking ideas and inspirational ways of thinking. With our thoughts, we make the world or we create our own reality. Let's take the responsibility to build and reinvent ourselves. Let's mindset engineer. Welcome to the works. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is uh, Johnny, and welcome to the Works uh, Podcast. So it's my duty to give you a brief introduction on what we're going to be doing here. So it's super simple. Uh, I've been doing this for quite some time, and I've been enjoying talking to people that have amazing stories, amazing concepts, ideas, and that are sometimes out of the ordinary that push you um that push you to going back into trying to rediscover yourself or trying to reinvent yourself and you know as we all hear the term that is super popular today you know personal development growth so we all want to be um improve and all kinds of different aspects in our life. So like I've been saying, I've been talking to so many interesting people and I decided to, you know, just start recording these uh, conversations and try to bring forward and giving some content to people to, you know, listen to while you're driving, while you're commuting to work, while you're chilling at home. So this is the general concept of this and we'll be touching on You know, concepts like mindset or uh, emotional intelligence. And the way I got kind of pushed into this is that so many people have asked me, um, you know, I try to help out the up and coming young folks coming into the industry. You know, I'm not an old fart, but um, there's some um, new kids on the block kind of coming out of school uh you know i've been an engineer for about almost 12 years now uh project managing uh you know from all the way from small scale scale to extremely large scale projects and um a lot of these guys coming in and they're asking me okay so what what should i look out for what am I looking into? So this is how I got started is tr- just trying to pave the road and kind of be a mentor to some of um, some of these people that I've, I work with and work beside. So, and at the end of the day, the other side of the, the, the equation is I've had so many mentors in my life, um, you know, trying to guide me and trying to me to open my eyes into different concepts. So I think that one of the most important tools anybody could have in their toolbox is communication. Communication is, this is where it all starts. It's, it starts in communication. If you don't know how to output your message, uh, that's where the, all the issues or the little bugs start. So, you know, there's once a a wise man that said the greatest way to learn is to listen. So these are two, you know, they're, they're, they're kind of like overlooked the skill of communication and the skill of listening. Uh, you know, you could have every, You could be an analytical genius, but the problem is, is once you analyze and you want to put forth your, your, your analysis, if you don't know how to communicate it, what good is it? So, you know, there's so many, so many different things that I want to touch on and, you know, I'll have, um, the general concept is I'll have some guests on my show. 
uh, whether it comes from, you know, um, uh, people that are into the fitness and health industry or people that are into the business side of things or entrepreneurs or influencers, right? It's the new thing now. Um, so I'm going to have these people coming in and we'll be chatting it up. We'll be recording. We'll be uh, sending it through. You guys could listen to it. Uh, and the general idea or, or this is what I want is back and forth communication. I want some input. I want some people that if they have any ideas to bring forward, please do so. Um, this is the this is the mainly the concept of the works podcast. And, you know, sharing is caring. It's as simple as that. Okay. The more you share, the better we'll all become, we'll have some, some growth, we'll have some, some, some ideas to share, we'll have some deep discussions, we'll go deep, don't worry about that, we'll go extremely, extremely deep into so many things, and the two things that I want to keep an eye on is mindset engineer, so I'll explain to you what's my idea of mindset, my uh, mindset engineer, Sorry about that. Very simple. Basically, I work as a project manager. So I manage projects. Okay. And after so many years of doing this, I one day I'm, I'm just looking at a project and I'm saying, holy crap, you know what? Us as humans individually... We are a project. So I'm, I look at myself in the mirror and I'm saying, me, myself, and I, I am a project. So why can't I apply the same concepts of managing a project towards managing myself? So in a project, you know, we have a budget, we have deadlines, we have scheduling, we have stakeholders, we have clients, communications, emails, meetings, whatever, whatever you want, and obviously delivering, delivering the final product. So why not apply those concepts to ourselves? Why not create a deliverable for ourselves, which means what are our goals? How can we get there? And how much time do we want to get this task uh, uh, well done? Or what? in what time frame do I want to learn this new skill? So I want to... The whole thing about this is that I want to kind of address or take my career and kind of tie it to how we manage ourselves. And this is super crucial. There's so many, in reality, there's so many good uh, podcasts out there. There's so many good books. There's so many good articles, websites, and there's so many people doing so many positive and enlightening things that I want to try to regroup those and kind of like communicate it outwards and present it to you. And I want to make this as relatable as possible for everybody. I want to make go back to basics. And like, you know, all these scientists have these crazy ass terms and big words and big analysis, just like engineers do myself when we do some uh, structural analysis. We have some we have some terms that the general population will not understand. So how can we explain this to people in the simplest in the simplest way possible? So how can we address that? So, like I said, this was just a super brief introduction. Uh, I kind of went a bit long-winded on this. I wanted to make it short and sweet, but you know, like like people that know me, once I start talking and I enjoy the topic, I'll just keep going. So, folks. This was an introduction. Uh, you could go check it out on 
I'll be posting. I'm not super huge on social media, but you could go follow me at Gcar Works on Instagram, which is G I C A R W O R K S. You could DM me. I'll be uh, answering you. It's me, myself, and I that manages uh, this account. Um, so you could DM me. You could like. You could follow. I'll be posting a lot of material on here. Um, I'll be posting links to the podcast, links to my website. I'll be sending some funny ass documents that you guys could reach out to. And you know what I want or what I would love from this is just sharing. Okay. Share it, talk to people about it, listen to it. And I would love to get just feedback. It could be negative. It could be positive. I don't mind. I'll go with it. I'll go with the flow. Um, and that's the, the the general concept of the Works Podcast. So I hope that I'll see you in the next episode. We have some really interesting stuff coming out. Uh, like I said, we'll be diving into mindset, fitness, health, meditation, uh, breath work, uh you name it, I have so many interesting people lined up. Um, so follow and please mindset engineer your day and have a wonderful day. Peace. Thank you. <laughs>